Hey everybody, welcome back to Monster Legends Legend, and today I am going to be demonstrating Materagon, uh, their skills in battle. Now I know I did one for the whole fugitive, but I'm going to actually just demonstrate him in the actual battle, and I'm going to run through various scenarios with him, so this way it's not just, okay, these are the four skills that you can use, um, there's going to be different things I'm going to test out. Um, so we are at a monster rank of zero. So we're, we only have the Fugitive Hater and the Immune to Control. But as you can see, the list goes, you know, gets better and better the higher you rank this monster up. So for this one, I am going to put the Applies Double Damage and Evasion to itself. Because I kind of started thinking how I can pair this with other monsters. And so I was like, um, I was like, yeah, I'm just going to jump into it and just, I like, that one is cool. Um, as far as like, you know, what is it called? The monster hater or whatever it's called a dragon hater. But I mean, there's not going to be, sometimes you're going to be in battle. You're not knowing who you're going up against when you do the player versus player one. And so that's why I don't, and that's what I primarily focus on is the player versus player. Um, right now I'm ranked like 750, I think, out of everybody. Let's see if I can hold on to being within the top 1,000. But I'm not going to use that Dragon Hater um, for the player versus player. Now, other aspects, yes, like when we're doing like the whole team battles, yeah, absolutely. You know, plug that in. Um, and definitely, you know, that'll give you an advantage. Triple van triple damage versus, you know, monsters in the dragon book. Absolutely. And for this one, I know I say I don't like using ruins. But I'm going to use ruins for this one because I need him to be a little bit faster than with some of the other monsters that I have. Just to kind of show what I am. What he's capable of doing. Um, so... I think that should be enough, a speed 10 and speed 7. So let's go ahead and get into it. <clears throat> hey, you'll excuse me. Oh, it's, what is it, 2,000 power right off the bat? You'll have to excuse me, just I'm still getting over my sickness. So if my throat just runs out, my bad guys, sorry. Okay, so I'm going to apply that double damage along with evasion. Now, Darman, he's going to shoot him up with triple damage as well. So let's see what he has now. 2,000 power, 500% damage. So let's just take them all out and see what type of damage it does. 360,000. So that's pretty sweet. That's... I was hoping for a little bit more, but like I said, he's he's at the very bottom as far as, you know, he's only at a level 100. So let's try it again. Let's see if I can get more damage the second go around. So we'll do the same exact thing. Actually, I decided not to. I want to see what it looked like without it. I was going to, but I kind of changed my mind the last second. So without all, you know, the triple damage, double damage, he only did 57,000 damage. So on this one, let's see. Let's see what I want to do on this one. <clears throat> I'm going to test out with a, a taunt monster and just see how much he takes out. All right, we'll just wait our turn. Okay, here we go. Five hundred and thirteen, and that's with massive magic um, that I just I just used. So that was pretty good. I was happy with that. 
you know, he did the whole insane magic damage to one. So that took him out pretty easily. But I also, you know, I have that one where it applies heavy um, damage, but it's not magic. It was just a, you know, whatever skill. Sorry, I can't remember what the name of it is. Um, but I have not done one with just pure magic to take out all three at the same time. So that's what I'm, I'm testing out now. Dogman's going to give me triple damage, and then we're going to see what he can do when I take it out all three with the magic. It's moderate magic. It's not, you know, major magic or, you know, um, heavy magic or whatever. It's just... Okay, so not, not too bad. Um, but yeah, that's it. I just wanted to kind of showcase some of his skills, how you can interchange him and whatnot. Um, like I said, if you are going up against the, like, Serpentex, this monster, if you know ahead of time that you're going to be going up against Serpentex, um, you can strategize to put in the Dragon Hater as one of the available skills to take him out. So, you use that against Serpentex, that's really going to help you out. Uh, let me know what you think about this monster. Then let me know what you think about his evolving traits. Is this a monster that you guys would love to have? Um, or are you just going to pass on this one? And let me know in the comments section. I'd love to hear from all my legends. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And until next time, I will talk to all my legends later. Have a great day.